Hat. <laughs> Give us a smile. <laughs> Uh, sadly, uh, my costume is my way, but the rest of my stuff in there. Put me army, little panoramic show. Oh, well. This is honestly so, so cool. Like, it makes me want to be an actor so bad. Hi, Harry. Hi, hello. Can I see around, please? I want to start up a bakery. <laughs> Are you ready? Are you ready? <laughs> good morning, everyone. So, I am finally back vlogging. It feels so good to just pick up my camera. Now I'm doing something that's remotely interesting and able to film. I am so excited just to be back in London and back filming. I don't know why I can't film in Sheffield, you'll have seen. If you saw the last vlog, I went to Sheffield for two weeks and literally filmed nothing. So, haha. <laughs> I'm so quirky these days, it's actually kind of ridiculous. Anyway, today I'm actually heading to Harry Potter World in the evening, so that's probably going to be the main bulk of this vlog. However, I need to get up, I need to put some washing in, I need to have a breakfast, I need to do all that fun stuff. I need to head to Westfield. But yeah, that's the situation. I'm going to Harry Potter World tonight. I'm so fucking excited. I've never been before. We watched, um, oh my god, what's it called? Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them. I know it's not Harry Potter, but like it's kind of the same thing, basically. Not really, but also kind of is. So hi, JK Rowling. Hi. So we watched that last night just to get in the mood. We were gonna watch Harry Potter, but like we always do this thing where we start watching Harry Potter and then we have to watch them all. So then our entire like week is just consumed with us watching Harry Potter, which is not a bad thing. We've got shit to do. So I'm gonna get out of bed. I'm gonna stop rambling. I hope you're excited for the vlogs to come. Big Beauty Day Out is literally next weekend. I'm so freaking excited. There's just a lot happening. I'm so glad to be able to be pick up my camera and be back vlogging. So I'm gonna go make myself some breakfast and then we're gonna get on with the day, aren't we, honey? I hate that. I also have a sore throat and need to shave, so. Fun facts with Byron. So I've decided the first thing on the agenda is to actually have a shower. Now, I have, oh shit, I just poured everything everywhere. I have a bunch of stuff that's just been in my wardrobe for the longest time. It's a bunch of like face stuff, like this thing from Kiehl's that I got for Christmas ages ago, and I've never used it. So whilst I've got time, and whilst I've got like the morning free, I am um, gonna just look through what I've got and see if I've got any products in here that I wanna use or wanna try or whatever. Hi, Pussy Hole. Hi, yeah. How's back in my vlog? You've not been in my vlog since I've been back. I mean, my foot can go in it because I don't discuss it. See? So, we've got a box of goodies and I'm gonna have a little look through them. So, what's this? A face scrub, charcoal face scrub, deep cleansing, purifying, and smoothing for clear and refined shine. Alright, I'm gonna take this into the shower with me. I'm gonna try this out. <laughs> All right, so it's been a little while since I've actually picked up my camera. As you can see, I'm now dressed and ready to go. We are basically heading to Harry Potter, like I said this morning. I basically woke up, had my breakfast, like you will have seen. I then have just been editing some videos and doing some stuff on my laptop. Nothing much that I could film. And then it is now... 4.15 in the afternoon. So it's only been a few hours actually since I actually last spoke to you. But we are now gonna head over to the tube station. We're gonna head to Westfields first because we need to go to the post office and we just kinda wanna have a little mooch around Westfield. So we're gonna do that. And then we've gotta head to, I don't know where we've gotta head to. It begins with a W, that's all I know. So we've gotta head there. And then we're gonna get from wherever this place is. I think it's Watford. I don't wanna be wrong. So we're heading to Mysterious W place. And then we've got a shuttle picking us up from there to take us to the Harry Potter studios. I am so freaking excited. This is what I'm wearing. It's a basic outfit, but I'm gonna show you anyway. I just have this purple jumper on, which I am absolutely loving at the minute. I want to get more of these. So I got this purple jumper on, just some mom jeans, of course, my Balenciaga shoes, a little off-white bag, and then my off-white hat as well. I really am turning into that bitch. But that is the situation. We're gonna head out the door now. I'm literally just waiting for her. She's filming a vlog clip, and then we are gonna head to Harry Potter. I am so freaking excited. I can't wait. So let's head there now and see what the situation is. <laughs> <laughs> Give us a smile. <laughs> Look where we are. I don't really know what the plan is or what the situation is, but we're like in a big room right now full of a bunch of people. How do you know? Oh, it says it on that sheet. It says it on the invitation, which I've not read. But we've arrived. We're in a room full of people. Oh my god. I didn't realise that was there. We just know one. Really? Yeah, with the snow coming down. I didn't realise that was there. Two ago. Anyway, we've arrived. We've just been having some little snacks from the canopy. Really nice, really fun and fresh. A woman just offered me some butternut squash and I said I don't like squid. Because I read it wrong, so. It's quite emotional driving through the gate here, remembering uh, the first time I ever came here to these studios. We shot like it. There's nothing like this anywhere in the world. We've been part. We go to uh, places based on them, but this is, this is where we are going to Sadly, uh, my costume is my way, and the rest of my stuff in there.
so so cool. Like it makes me want to be an actor so bad. I'm literally walking around like, oh my god, this is how this is done. This is how this was done. It's so so cool. Like I'm actually obsessed. I want to be an actor like now. Please, thanks. <laughs> Next Harry Potter. Hi. I love that this is green screen on the inside. Like it makes sense because it's obviously the invisibility cloak. But like I don't know why. I didn't think it would be green screen. Anyway, we're signing these little passports. We get little stamps when we go around. It's not focusing, but it's happening, and I'm really loving it. You know, we're the last ones. It's hard that anyone left in here because we're taking this long. Oh. What? <laughs> Get my passport stamped, you know, duty free is next door. You have to. <laughs> Got it? Wow, she's sick. Can you see it? Yeah, you can see it now. This scene is my favourite thing in what the entire world. Let it go. Oh my god, I love this. Like, I want to be an actor like now. If anyone, directors, producers, anyone wants to hire me on anything, any TV show, any film, hit me up. Guys, I told you not to bring your bear. I'm sorry, my jewel stick ran out. <laughs> Playing with some boys, so what's new? <laughs> Just on my own. Right, we're about to go on the Hogwarts Express. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what I keep doing. Yeah. 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 Has the woman's behind you. This is so small. Oh, yeah, like the actors must have been tiny. I am so yeah. small. I am <laughs> <laughs> Look how cool this is. <laughs> this is the quiet carriage one. <laughs> Fucking glass of water there, no one's drinking it. Oh my god, that vintage jacket. I think I saw that on Depot the other day. Oh, it's smelling nice. It smells like crusty, like crusty, dusty mustard. Fucking people these days on the Hogwarts Express. Right, so just to preface what has we're on about whilst we were in there, I was taking a photo. Oh, with the little trolley thing, you know, nine and three quarters, running into the wall, and has to take a photo. And a woman came over and was like, "Oh my god, can I take a photo of you?" Marry me. Too. I thought that was a woman. <laughs> This woman comes over and she's like, oh my god, can I take a photo of you doing that too? So then this woman just took a photo of me pushing the thing into the wall and I was like, oh, it's sure. On platform nine and three quarters, I was a model. Hi, you brown love. Harry. Harry, love, can I just borrow that suitcase of yours for a beauty day out? Right, we've got some butterbeer ice cream. I'm going to try it. I didn't try it in LA, but everyone else did, so now is my time to shine. Mm, put it in your mouth, daddy. Like it? This is sort of I knew it! I knew it! I knew it! Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, here we are! This is insane! What the freak? Oh my god! This is so so cool! Oh my god, look, Haz, how it's not like an actual house house, but from the outside, it looks like an actual house house! Hi, Harry! Oh my goodness, that is the coolest oh, thing! Wow! Put me army, little panoramic shot. Oh, well, it literally is just that one room. That's so funny. Oh my god. <laughs> I hate this. You're a wizard. That's like your nose before you had fill up. My nose before filler. Yeah. I'll tell you it was more of that. Oh, all that. That was a kink in it. So everyone, just to preface, I look like shit, but I'm just popping in here to explain what just happened in the last clip. Basically, Haz goes up to the little goblin guy, my ear looks massive, Haz goes up to the little goblin guy and asks for 10 grand to open a bakery, which is really iconic and ironic because we walked around with the guy from Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them, and in the first film, he goes to the bank and asks us for 10 grand to open a bakery. The man is in the room at this point and me and Haz both realised that she kind of fucked up. She kept making jokes and references to the film on accident without remembering that the guy who literally acted in the film and said those exact lines was like 10 feet behind us. So that's why we look at each other like, bitch really just did say that when he's like 10 feet behind us. 
Anyway, continue with the vlog. This is literally insane. Oh, oh my god. The attention to detail in this like place is just ridiculous, like actually insanely ridiculous, but I love it so much. I just can't get over the fact that the actors actually like did their job every single day on these sets. Like that must be so much fun. I want to be an actor so bad, like I actually do. However, acting school is just really fucking expensive, so I love that for me. Oh my god, what are you doing here? Um, I need to wear any green or you bitches. <laughs> Hi kitty girls, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Hi everyone, welcome back. I haven't vlogged in the longest time. I don't know what the last clip will have been. It will have been us in Harry Potter world, but I don't know why it exactly was. However, we've been to Harry Potter world. It's been, it's done, it's happened. I absolutely loved it. It was actually incredible. Freya, I saw you come to my door. Freya's trying to play a prankster. It is now like 2am, basically. We left Harry Potter World. Also, thank you so much to Warner Brothers and Sarcher and everyone for getting us, whoever got us invited there. Thank you, it was incredible. Like, I appreciate it so, so much. Like, honestly, we saw like some of the actors and it was so funny, actually. Yesterday, we watched Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them. And obviously, the guy in Fantastic Beasts, I don't know if you've seen it, but the guy who, the guy that bumps into Eddie Redmayne in the beginning of the film, we um, walked the entire way of the tour with him, like I tour with him. They're really really cool obviously because he's like such a good actor and he's like the main actor in the film that we literally watched yesterday. But yeah there were a bunch of actors there, a bunch of YouTubers there, I've seen quite a lot of people that I recognise, a lot of familiar faces. It was just overall really cool and Harry Potter Studios is insane as well. Like I have never been to anything like that apart from when we went to Harry Potter World in uh, Anaheim when we went to LA last year and honestly it was so so freaking good. I absolutely loved it even though I'm not like a super die hard Harry Potter fan like has and Freya are. I just thoroughly enjoyed the whole experience. I thought it was great. I can't remember what the last clip I filmed was, so I'm trying to think back. But we basically left Harry Potter World, got the shuttle bus back, and then we had an hour long tube journey back to our house, which were really not fun or fresh, so I didn't film any of it. And then we basically got KFC on the way back home, came back home, and to our surprise, Anastasia, Miss Kings North, was actually around ours. We thought she would come around tomorrow, but apparently she had been pranking us this entire time and she was lying to us when she was actually coming because she came today instead. We've got any friends tomorrow in the evening. I think we're gonna go out tomorrow daytime as well. I think this was a really fun, exciting start to kick off the vlogs again. Um, like I said so many times, we've got so many exciting things coming up this month. I hope you're all excited. If you are, let me know. Stay tuned. I love you all lots and I will see you in the morning. Good night everyone. It smells like Hermione's musty crust in there. <laughs>